All right, so this is not the video I really wanted to do, but this is gonna be an important video, learning experience for me and anybody who's dealing with this injury. I am dealing with a tri-malleolar fracture. So that is three fractures in the ankle. And it kind of looks a little bit something like this for right now. So being that the swelling was so severe, they couldn't operate on me right at this current moment. So they had to set the bone. And that means I get to sit around with rods in my leg for the next couple days. So wish me luck. And let's flash back a week. And this is what my ankle looked like at the emergency room. And then this is what it looked like as I was waiting to get surgery for eight hours. Finally, out of the hospital, this is what it looked like. Look at all those pins, look at all the rods, the external fixator. All right, so we're at day one at the house. Still got the pins and needles. We got the nurses coming in tomorrow. Let's see how it goes. To be honest, wait till you try to shower with something like this. It is a pain in the ass. You're gonna need some help, I'm not gonna lie. It's tough. Look at my face too. You can see I fell hard on the face. Guy got me good. All right. So it's the first morning out of the hospital, and we had a little, I guess, accident. I guess whenever I fell asleep for a little bit, one of the screws got loose. I don't want to say loose, but it started bleeding because there's blood here. So ink was a little sore. And um, luckily the nurse is coming over. She's going to treat my wounds. And uh, hopefully this doesn't happen again. I guess I must have got it stuck. I mean, it kind of hurts like hell. I ain't going to lie. But <sighs> what are you going to do? This is the external fixator in my leg. Look at that thing. The worst part about, I mean, here is I've never been in the position where I've been helpless and I literally feel helpless and if it isn't for the people that you know friends and family and people you love around you that you know actually care for you that help you out I mean that's the best thing you can possibly have and unfortunately the hardest thing for me right now is trying to get to the damn bathroom I mean that's <laughs> I'm hobbling on one leg trying to take a pee and I'm peeing on one leg. And I haven't pooped in four days, so this is this is great. All right, so we are on what? What is this, day six? Oh, this is day seven. This is day seven. Tomorrow, I finally get these things taken out of my leg. And as you can see, this has not been fun. I got my a little leg rest, trying not to get that bolt hitting anything. And so I've been sitting like this for seven days. It needs to come out like this. You can see I'm getting scruffy. I don't even have a haircut. I haven't shaved. This is just, <laughs> we'll see what happens tomorrow when I get these things out of my leg. I'll keep you updated.